Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel, Online Dating Today. Today, we're going to talk about a critical topic, how scammers operate in online dating. In the digital age, finding love online has become increasingly popular, but unfortunately, it has also given scammers new opportunities to prey on unsuspecting individuals. In this video, we'll show you how scammers operate in online dating and share some valuable tips on how to protect yourself. So, let's dive in. 1. Fake Profiles Fake profiles are a common trick used by scammers in online dating. They steal attractive photos from the internet and create fictional identities with captivating bios. Using pre-written scripts, they approach multiple individuals, building emotional connections to gain trust. Once victims are emotionally invested, scammers reveal their hidden motives, such as asking for money or personal information. To protect yourself, stay cautious with new online connections, be skeptical of suspicious behavior, and avoid sharing sensitive details. Trust your instincts and report any potential scams to the dating platform. Stay safe and happy dating. 2. Catfishing Catfishing in online dating involves scammers creating fake personas with attractive photos to deceive and emotionally manipulate others. They build trust through charming conversations and shared interests, but avoid meeting in person. Catfishers aim to exploit victims emotionally or financially. To protect yourself, be cautious, verify information, and avoid getting too emotionally invested before meeting face-to-face -face or video chatting. Trust your instincts and be wary of any excuses to avoid in-person interactions. Stay safe and vigilant while dating online. 3. Love Bombing Love bombing in online dating is a manipulative tactic where scammers overwhelm their targets with excessive affection, compliments, and attention to create a quick emotional bond. They use flattery and declarations of love to make the victim feel special and emotionally attached. However, this intense affection is often a smokescreen to exploit the victim later on, such as asking for money or favors. To protect yourself, be cautious of people who rush into declarations of love and take time to get to know someone before developing strong emotional attachments. Trust your instincts and watch for any red flags in their behavior. Genuine connections are built on mutual respect and trust, not through overwhelming affection from the start. Stay vigilant and don't let love bombing cloud your judgment in online dating. 4. Quick Declarations of Love Quick declarations of love in online dating are when scammers rush to say I love you or express deep affection too soon. They do this to create a fast emotional connection and make the victim feel special. However, it's often a trick to manipulate the victim for their own gain, like asking for money. To stay safe, be cautious of people who rush into intense feelings early on. Genuine love takes time to develop, so don't let quick declarations cloud your judgment in online dating. Trust your instincts and take things slowly to avoid falling for scammers' emotional tricks. 5. Requests for Money Requests for money in online dating are a major warning sign of scams. After building an emotional connection, scammers use sad stories or emergencies to make victims feel sympathetic and urgently send money. They may ask for funds for medical bills, travel expenses, or business opportunities. Scammers pressure victims to act fast and may threaten dire consequences if they don't comply. Remember, genuine partners won't rush into money requests, so be cautious and never send money to someone you haven't met in person. Report any suspicious behavior to the dating platform and seek advice from trusted friends or family to avoid falling for scams. 6. Investment Scams Investment scams in online dating involve scammers pretending to offer lucrative investment opportunities. They create an attractive profile, claim to be successful investors, and promise high returns. They may share fake documents and testimonials to make it seem legitimate. However, there is no real investment, and their goal is to get you to send them money. Be cautious of sudden investment offers and high-pressure tactics. Research thoroughly and consult trusted financial advisors before committing to any investment. Genuine opportunities won't rush you or ask for money up front. If you suspect a scam, stop communication, report the person, and inform the authorities. Stay alert to protect your finances and avoid falling for investment scams in online dating. 7. 
long-distance relationships. Long-distance relationships in online dating can be a setup for scammers. They claim to be far away, making it hard to meet in person. Scammers use emotional tactics, virtual gifts, and promises of future visits to build a strong connection. However, they avoid video chats or in-person meetings, raising red flags. Their goal might be money or personal information. Be cautious of such relationships, and don't send money to someone you haven't met. Genuine partners will find ways to communicate beyond texts and will eventually meet you. Trust your instincts, and if you suspect a scam, report it and seek advice from trusted friends or family. Stay alert to avoid falling for long-distance relationship scams in online dating. 8. Refusal to meet in person or video chat Refusal to meet in person or video chat is a big red flag in online dating. Scammers often make excuses to avoid face-to-face -face interactions because it would reveal their true identity. They prefer text-based communication to keep their deception going. This behavior is typical in catfishing and romance scams. A genuine person will eventually be open to meeting and video chatting. If someone consistently avoids these, be cautious, question their motives, and consider ending communication. Prioritize your safety by not sending money or personal information to anyone you haven't met or verified. Trust your instincts, report suspicious behavior, and focus on building connections with sincere individuals in online dating. 9. Blackmail Blackmail is a dangerous scam in online dating. Scammers gain sensitive information or explicit photos from victims during emotional interactions and use it as leverage to threaten and control them. They demand money or engage in fraud, threatening to share the compromising material with the victim's friends and family if they don't comply. To protect yourself, be cautious about sharing personal information or explicit content with strangers online. If you experience blackmail, don't give in to their demands, report the incident to the authorities and the dating platform. Genuine relationships are built on trust, not fear and manipulation. Stay safe and prioritize your well-being in online interactions. 10. Identity Theft Identity theft is a serious scam in online dating. Scammers pretend to be interested in you, get personal information like your name and address, and then use it to commit fraud in your name. They might open credit cards or take loans, leaving you with financial problems. To stay safe, be cautious with personal information, especially with people you haven't met. Use strong passwords and monitor your financial accounts regularly. If you suspect identity theft, act quickly by reporting it to the authorities and your financial institutions. Protect yourself from this harmful scam in online dating. To protect yourself from online dating scams, here are some tips. 1. Beware of love bombers and money requests. When dating online, be cautious and skeptical of people who rush into declaring love or ask for money quickly. Genuine relationships take time to develop, so be wary of excessive affection early on. Scammers may use love bombing tactics to manipulate you emotionally. Also, avoid sending money to someone you've just met online, as scammers may fabricate stories to exploit your generosity. Stay informed about common online dating scams, trust your instincts, and prioritize your safety. Take your time getting to know someone and build trust before sharing personal or financial information. Focus on building genuine connections with people who respect your boundaries. 2. Using reverse image search for safer online dating. Using reverse image search tools is a helpful way to check if the photos someone uses in their dating profile are stolen from the internet. Just upload the picture to the search tool, and it will show you if the image appears elsewhere online. This helps you spot potential scammers or catfishers using fake identities. Remember to respect privacy and only use this method for publicly available photos. Although it's not foolproof, it's a valuable tool to stay safe in online dating and verify the authenticity of the person you're talking to. 3. Avoid sharing sensitive personal information. Avoid sharing sensitive personal information in online dating to protect your privacy and avoid scams. This includes details like your full name, address, phone number, and financial information. Scammers may try to exploit your trust to get this information and use it for identity theft or fraud. 
Be cautious about clicking on links or downloading attachments from new contacts. Take your time to build trust with someone before revealing more personal details. Genuine connections are based on mutual respect, and it's essential to prioritize your safety and privacy in online dating. Trust your instincts and be mindful of what information you share to stay safe. 4. Arrange first meetings in public places and inform a friend or family member. When meeting someone from online dating for the first time, choose a public place like a cafe or restaurant. Let a friend or family member know the details of your date, including where and when you'll meet, and share the person's name and profile. Keep your phone charged and have a friend on standby to check in on you during the date. Trust your instincts and be observant of the person's behavior. If anything feels off, end the date and leave. Prioritizing your safety is essential in online dating, even though most people are genuine and well-intentioned. Taking these precautions can help ensure a safer and more enjoyable experience when meeting new people. 5. If someone asks for money or exhibits suspicious behavior, report them and cut off communication immediately. If someone asks for money or behaves suspiciously in online dating, take immediate action. Cut off communication with them right away and don't send money to anyone you've just met online. Report the person to the dating platform and seek help if you've already sent money or shared sensitive information. Prioritize your safety and don't feel embarrassed about reporting suspicious behavior. Being vigilant and taking quick action can protect you from scams and help make online dating safer for everyone. Remember, online dating can be a fantastic way to meet new people and find love, but always proceed with caution. By staying informed and vigilant, you can protect yourself from falling victim to online dating scams. Don't forget to follow these tips and share this video with your friends and family to keep them safe too. If you have any other topic suggestions, leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Stay safe and happy dating.